Hi, how are you? I hope everyone's okay today. Um, today I've got a free exercise for your core. Yeah, for this part here, it gets all around there, but you're gonna be working a lot in your um, intra abdominal muscles. Yeah, your obliques there, internal and external obliques. Very good exercise for you. If you are a middle lifer like me, I'm 58 years old, and uh, this is important. Um, this is your center of gravity. This is your body. You need this bit here of your body, strong and strong. Because if you are walking outside, you have to make sure when you're walking, you're feeling um, your muscles, your muscle stabilizers right there. They are strong. So that's why I'd like to show you um, free exercise I'm going to be using, you can see my resistance bands. I'm going to do the first exercise. Um, um, I'm going to show you the movement, how you should do it. And the second one, I'm going to put this bit here, right down in here. That's the second one. And the third one's going to be here. I'm going to show you in three um, videos, all right? So the first one, Basically, I'm gonna show you. You're gonna hold the hands here. You're gonna do this movement, right? So when you twist to my, I'm twisting to my left side, I'm contracting your core. So when I say contract your core, suck your core in. If you suck the in, you're gonna feel your obliques working. So that's the movement. If I grab those one, those handles, as you can see here, yeah? Oh, another thing I'd like to say. If you ask me, oh, how, what about the resistance? Um, you have to like, uh, it's that's not strong, you see? So if it is um, a black one I have, it's gonna be too hard for me to do the movement. So find one of the, 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 uh, the resistance, they are not strong, too strong for yourself, okay? So basically what you have to do is, you hold together here, yeah? Suck your core in, and you do this movement there. Yeah, don't let that happen. Yeah, so control the movement. Look at me and control it down. So the handles is coming towards my knee, right? And back again. So if you do more like a non stop, that's the result you're gonna get it, right? Squeeze and squeeze and squeeze. So so when I'm twisting to my left side, at the same time, I'm sucking my core and I can feel the muscles work. This is a very good exercise, especially if you're in my club, if you're a middle life uh, man or woman, you have to do this, okay? So you're gonna go now on to the second exercise, okay? Hi guys, um, as I said to you, um, we're going on to the second exercise now. Second exercise, if you see what I've just done here, it's, uh, I just put the, um, the thing here under the door, yeah? Because the movement is gonna be from down up. And I, I've still got the same resistance to do it. And uh, something I'd like to say, if you, if, you like, um, if you like playing golf, yeah? If you, sometimes you go to Spain or whatever, you go to Portugal or here in the UK, um, so you can, this is a good exercise for golfers if you like playing golf. So that's going to really strengthen your core. And that's, that's, that's why I'm here to tell you, you have to do this. This is important for you. And if you play your golf, you're going to have a better swing, a very strong swing. You're going to send the ball from here to Japan. Let's put it this way. Anyway, how do you do it? Um, basically, uh, you, you have to... As I did on the very first exercise, you've been watching so far. So you grab it, yeah? So you go up and down. Don't forget to suck your core in, really suck your core in, up and down. Another thing is, when you return, don't let it go like loose like that, yeah? Keep always under tension, this. This is important, uh, you remember, this has to be under tension. Otherwise, you're gonna lose that kind of momentum here. Look. If I go up and I go like that, there is no resistance, yeah, against my core. So if you keep the resistance, good resistance, you go up and I can feel the tension there. Up, and if you feel it's 
still a little bit loose, you move a little bit away and you try again, okay? So that's the movement you do it. Up and down, up and down. Really, I can feel that, okay? Up and down. So one more thing I'd like to say, if you're not quite sure, oh, how many reps I should do it? I'd say you have to do it. Um, as many as you can feel the burning there, there, but I, you should aim for like a 20 reps about. And if you can do more than 20 reps, that's great. Okay, so next one, you're gonna go on to the third exercise. Hi, here we go again. So we're gonna go on to the third exercise. The third exercise, again, you're still working right there, your core, but the movement is a bit different. If you have been watching till here, um, you saw the fourth exercise, I start on the bottom. You saw the second one, I start at the top. And the third one comes here, right, okay, the middle door. So basically, if you follow the technique I've, I've been telling you, make sure this, you keep under tension all the time you're doing the movement. So when you return, don't let it go loose. If you let it go loose and you lose the tension there. So how are you gonna do this one? Basically, hold again, yeah? See my position here? I'm not, I'm not really standing like that. Nice position, contract your core, suck your core in. Contra um, one thing I'd like to say is think about, connect your brain to this, yeah? So that's what I'm doing. Hold it, swing. I can feel it, I can feel, because I'm sucking my core and don't let that happen, okay? So, go, go, go. How many reps? Remember I've told you, 20 maybe, or more. I really like doing this one. You see, I'm not moving my foot like that. So they are stuck there, my feet are stuck there on the ground. I just bend a little bit my knee, lock, and I go. You're gonna enjoy doing this. It's lovely doing this one. So basically, these are three exercises. They're not difficult to do, are they? So for us midlifers, we have to do this. Um, whether you're 30, 40, 50, 60, uh, whatever age you are right now, you have to do. Do this one and you can get back to me. And um, yeah, I'll be coming back with other videos and I'll see you soon. Don't forget, you have to do this.